What is going on YouTube? It's your boy Billy Kibaki and in today's video I'll show you how to install the latest PS3 hand version 3.0.2 on your PS3. So some of you might already took the 4.87 update and you no longer have your hand functions or some of you might be avoiding the update and you're no longer able to go online. Well in this video I'll show you how to install the latest PS3 hand on your PS3. Also you will need the latest HFW that's 4.87.1 HFW you will need that. Also make sure that you have your USB cable for your controller you will also need that as well. Keep in mind PS3 hand can be installed on any PS3 but it's mostly meant for the non jailbreakable PS3. PS3 Hen is the closest thing you will have next to an actual jailbroken PS3. You can still install PS3 Hen on any PS3 out there. Alright, so let's go ahead and get started. The first thing you will need guys is the HFW 4.87.1. The links will be in the description so make sure that you read through the description. Inside that folder you will find a folder called PS3 inside that update and right here we have the pub update file. Copy this folder and then head over to your USB device. This is my USB device. Make sure that your USB device is formatted to FAT32. So click on it, go to format. This will erase everything on your USB stick. Everything will be deleted, gone. Okay, make sure that FAT32 is selected, then click start. That's it, format complete. Now go inside your USB device, go to properties, and you can double check to make sure that it's actually FAT32. Go ahead and paste your file right there. Okay, once the file has been transferred over to your USB stick, go ahead and remove it and let's head over to the PS3. Okay, now that you're on the PS3, make sure that you plug the USB in the right USB port. You can use any USB port, but I like to recommend using the right USB port on the PS3. So go ahead, log into your user. And from right here, guys, let me go ahead and show you my system um, information. Oh, let me show you. There's no PS3 hand. There's no hand enabler because I did the update and it removed my... Um, and enabler so there's no hand enabler on my ps3 let me show you my system information right here there it is 4.87 now there's two options one you can update the ps3 you can install the hfw 4.87.1 you can install it from right here and go to storage media you can install it from right here, but some of the time this might give you an error message. Not really an error message, but it will give you a message saying that the latest version is already installed. So I would recommend guys that you go to recovery mode, put the PS3 in recovery mode. So I'm going to show you how to put the, the PS3 in recovery mode. That way you don't get that message. So let's go ahead and turn off the PS3 and put it in recovery mode. So make sure that your console is off. As you guys can see, there's the power button and it's showing the red light. So my console is currently off. Okay, so press and hold the power button until the console turns on. So press and keep your finger on the power button. It will beep. Okay, then it's going to beep again and then shuts off. And that's it it turns right back off now go ahead and press and hold the power button again and it's gonna beep one more time and then two times um, consecutive and then you release there's one there's the other two so right now the PS3 should be booting up with um... okay guys so once you get this message plug the USB cable in the PS3 and plug it to the controller now press the PS button on the controller. When you get to this options right here, go down to number six, system update, press X. 
right here you want to press start and select on your controller at the same time and just sit back and wait for the install to take place okay everyone so the installation of the 4.87.1 hfw has been installed correctly now we can log into our user and let me just go ahead and show you guys again let me show you my system information as well keep in mind guys the system software version it will not say hfw 4.87.1 it will never say that all right so let's go ahead press circle go all the way over to internet browser right here what you want to do is set a blank page so press triangle go up to tools go down to home page and you want to select use blank page press X then go down to OK close the browser then enter the browser again press start on your controller you want to delete this then type the ps3exploit.com address press start again go up to the top left corner where you see ps3 hand go down to hen installer alternate press X this is the one that I normally use it works just fine so press X if this page gives you a fail message you can press triangle go down to bookmark and you want to bookmark this page right here close the browser and then enter the browser again if you get a fail right if you get a fail you do that I'm just showing you guys all the options so when you close the browser and you enter the browser again now press select and then you will see the bookmark press X it will take you back right to the page and it works perfect there you go now follow the instructions guys press circle and exit the browser go up to remote play press X when you get this on your screen press circle okay now we have hen in we have install hen right here press X press X again it's telling you to get this software you need to download it first press yes okay install completed press circle now go all the way over to turn off system and we're gonna restart the system okay so restart your PS3 okay everyone so the PS3 has just restarted so log into your user let's head over to the game column and as you all can see we now have enable hen once again so let's go ahead and try it out and there you go so the latest hen 3.0.2 I can load my games up and everything I can log in let's go ahead and log in So there you go. I am logged in. I can load my games. And there you go. So yeah, that's it guys. That's how easy it is to install the latest hand on your PS3. If the video was helpful, give it a like, share the video around, and also you guys can subscribe for more videos to come. Thank you all for watching and I will see you guys next time.